You've recently said that you've come to terms with your own mortality. Have you talked to your kids about carrying on this legacy and taking they over? They do. They just do anyway. What's most important to me is they're kind, uh, empathetic, uh, compassionate, brilliant people. <laughs> well, how could they not, Michael? They are a product of you and Tracy. And you are just that. <laughs> it's Tracy's fault. <laughs> Michael J. Fox, though always funny, is very real. At 61, he knows he won't live to be 80. He's broken bones, an infection almost caused him to lose a finger. Daily struggles include walking and falling often. Nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you, you're not gonna have my feet. Michael's also not hiding the fact that his tremors from Parkinson's have progressed. Laughter is always my biggest, um, my first response to anything is what's funny about this. And sometimes it's hard. I mean, that's it. It's just, it's just, just looking for the joy in things. In his new documentary, Still, streaming tomorrow on Apple TV+, Plus, Michael also details his struggle with alcohol after his diagnosis, which he initially thought was a bad hangover at 29. You haven't had a drink in 30 years, but why did you want to open up about this aspect well, of your life? Well, because this is part of the way that we deal with it. Really? Um, I mean, I was just, I just was clearly using alcohol. To, 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 to cover to cover the disease. I think there, there are limitations with my size, but there aren't any limitations with the things I want to do, you know. Mallory. E.T.'s been with Michael since the very beginning, watching the actor turn activist bring awareness to the cause. To date, the Michael J. Fox Foundation rocket, has raised nearly $2 billion for Parkinson's disease research, and his wife Tracy has been by his side through it all. Can't wait to see you. Love uh, you. Could you imagine doing life with anyone else other than oh, no. Trace? Yeah. I'd be dead. This July, you'll celebrate your 35th wedding anniversary. Yeah, that's 25 years of my life. <laughs>